Hey guys, T here with a quick piece of Nintendo news. Shu Takumi has announced that on the Capcom YouTube and Twitter and on other Capcom social medias that the Ace Attorney Chronicles will finally be coming to the English-speaking territories. It was originally released on the 3DS in 2015 exclusively in Japan. The synopsis of the trailer reveals that you'll be playing as an ancestor to Phoenix Wright who is called Ryunosuke Naruhodo and he will have an assistant called Sasuto Mikotoba. She will be play the role of the assistant, like kind of like your Ma Maya Fei in the Phoenix Wright games. He also has a best friend called Kazuma Asogi. Um, other characters have been revealed, but the most interesting is Herlock Sholmes. In the Japanese game, he was referred to as Sherlock Holmes. He will be the detective of the game, just like Dick Gumshoe. I just hope he isn't as clumsy. The set in the game is at the turn of the 20th century and will take place between the Empire of Japan and the British Empire. The gameplay looks very similar to the past Ace Attorney games. You will have to build a case to defend your client and then you will go to the court to defend your client in the Battle of Wits against the prosecutor, Baron Van Zeeks. There are 10 cases and 8 escapades. The escapades are side stories that happen during the plot of the game. Overall, I am most impressed with this game finally seeing an English debut. If it launches on the PC, PS4 and Switch on the 27th of July 2021. However, if you either pre-order the game or get it at launch, you will also have access to From the Vaults, which will feature additional artwork and music um, from the game, which you can access in the game. Um, there's also a bundle that's going to release for the Ace Attorney, the Great Ace Attorney Chronicles and the Phoenix Wright Trilogy, the 2019 release. But how do you feel? about this Japanese exclusive game finally being released in the West. Are there any other Japanese games you'd like to see come to the West? Be sure to let us know in the comment sections below. And don't forget to subscribe for all things Nintendo.